welcome back to my channel jasmine denise here if you are new thank you so much for tuning in go ahead and hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you're notified when i drop new content and if you're an oldie but a goodie thank you so much for coming back we're almost at 50 subscribers and i am so appreciative for you guys thank you so much for supporting um i am doing a giveaway and i will put the details for the giveaway in the description box because it will be starting on october 1st so go to the description box to find out the information on that today i have a long awaited video for you guys um it's the louis vuitton bum bag um i asked you guys on instagram if you guys wanted to see um my first chanel purchase and how long the bag has been holding up or did you guys want to see my louis vuitton new pickup um and you guys chose a louis vuitton purchase so i'm here bringing that content to you guys today i don't want to ramble too much but let's go ahead and get right into the video so i am going to be giving you details on the bag um where i purchased the bag the price of the bag pros and cons do i think you guys should um purchase from the actual site or from a reseller and if i think you should just add it to your collection or not so let's get right into it um so the bag did come to me um in the dust bag it didn't come to me in a louis vuitton box because i did not purchase it from um louis vuitton's website because if you guys don't know about the bum bag every time they restock it pretty much sells out like immediately so i purchased it from stock x um, and i am going to give you the details on that but let's go ahead and take it out of the dust bag do, 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 do. and this is the bag right here let me zip it up y'all i wear this bag a lot so sorry that it wasn't zipped up but this is the bag here it is um the monogram print with natural cowhide leather um and as you can see the nice finish on it the nice glazing um let me get a little close so you guys can see have the Louis Vuitton tab here it has a gold hardware as you guys can see it has gold hardware on the back on the straps and it has a wonderful top handle which I love and also you have the adjustable straps it's not detachable but um, that's cool. So, also has the gold hardware D ring here. Um, so let me just go ahead and give you guys um, the specs. So on the website, on Louis Vuitton website, the bag is retailing for seventeen sixty, um, and I'm looking at the site right now, and it's actually sold out, which that was a problem I had. So, what I had to do was purchase from StockX. So I purchased it um, and the bag, the purchase price was $19.66, but sales tax and processing fees and shipping fees, um, the bag came up to $21.54.28. So I did pay a little bit more than I would like to pay, but it's such a staple bag that I feel like, you know, can't go wrong with it. So, and this is the bag here. It has plenty of room. Let me go ahead and open it up for you guys so you can see. And the, the zipper is so sturdy. And this flap kind of like comes up. Um, This is the inside of the bag. Plenty of space. Inside it says Louis Vuitton Paris, made in France. And then you also have the zipper in the back which it's plenty of space like my whole hand is in here <clears throat> so what I noticed is on the front of the bag the LVs are up on the top of the bag the LVs are up on the back the LVs are down which I don't mind I think it's super cute um, and I'm actually going to put some of my essentials in here so you guys can kind of see, kind of gauge how much spacing is in the bag. So I have my wallet, my AirPods. I even bought some lady products. And I'm going to put my keys in here. 
And you guys can see my keys are like, I have a lot going on on the keys. Everything in there. Unzip it up. The flat down. And everything is in the bag. It doesn't look bul bulky. It's not bulging out. Um, it's perfect. So I'm going to show you guys how I would like to wear it. I like to wear it um, to the side like this. This way. And also with the top handle, just, you know, walking around with my bag like this. Um, and like I said, the straps are on the back are not um, detachable, but it's a bum bag. So, I mean, if you're looking for something where you can take the straps off that has like the top handle like this, I would recommend maybe the makeup bag that you guys can walk around with. As I see a lot of people, you know, walk around with that bag like that. But as far as the bag, um, the pros of the bag to me is just like the whole the whole look of the bag the whole style of the bag and how much space it has those will be my pros for the cons of the bag i don't really have any cons for the bag really um not for myself but i would say for someone else probably maybe the straps not being um detachable for them that may be a con but i really don't have any complaints about this bag i love this bag so much it's such a stable piece i will always um have this in my collection so i pretty much rate the bag 10 out of 10 um do i recommend it to someone who's first purchasing a louis vuitton bag for the first time i definitely do i feel like if you are purchasing um louis vuitton for the first time i would definitely recommend this bag for the first purchase um just because like i said it, you can't go wrong with it it's such a staple piece um to add to your collection and yeah so i feel like this bag is going to have long wear um it's going to last for a long time and i will like i said always have this in my collection um do i regret paying the price that i paid i do not regret paying it because like i said i love the bag so much um and it's just such a stable piece so um that's pretty much all the information that i have for you guys on the bag um, if you guys have any other questions on the bag, you guys can definitely ask me down in the description box and I would gladly answer those questions for you. Um, if you guys want any more information as far as like purchasing from, you know, resellers or whatever, things like that, um, you guys can ask me that as well. Do I wish I would have been able to purchase it from the Louis Vuitton store? Mm, it doesn't really matter because one, this is not my first Louis Vuitton purchase. Um, so it didn't bother me to not have the, you know, the actual Louis Vuitton um, box that, you know, comes with the, when you purchase from Louis Vuitton, that gold looking box, it didn't matter to me. Um, but I will say someone for the, that's purchasing the bag for the first time or purchasing from Louis Vuitton for the first time, you might want to have that experience to just um, purchase from them where you actually would, you know, get your box. And, um, but the dust bag was enough for me. So I'm cool with everything about this bag. I love it so much. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I know you guys have been waiting for this um, video for a very long time, but I finally have it here for you guys. So um, I will also leave the link to where I purchased the bag in the description box so that you guys can maybe purchase. I haven't looked online to see if they still have it on StockX, but um, if I can find it anywhere I can find it, I will put the link down in the description for you. Um, but that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for tuning in. Again, if you're a new person to the channel, please subscribe to the channel um, and follow me on Instagram so that you can know when I am getting ready to post new videos. Um, I'm always doing polls on there, asking questions, what kind of content you guys want to see. So make sure you're following me on there so you can stay up to date with me on all of my platforms. And um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys. Thank you.